hello and welcome to you all once again in learn more youtube channel today i am here with one new question which is related to flowchart as you can see in your screen draw flowchart to find greater number among three numbers okay let's get started at first as you know that our flowchart always starts with google symbol with start yeah go to insert to shapes and select the oval symbol you can see here and drag over here yeah this is your oval symbol inside this oval symbol you have to write start so a text and start yeah this is your step. and after let's use arrow exactly from middle then it looks nice yeah and after as we are going to find the greater number among three numbers so we will enter three numbers again to enter we have parallelogram shape we have to use parallelogram shape go to shape and select the parallelogram here it is the parallelogram shape parallelogram shape then drag over here parallelogram shape now take it in middle and it looks nice yeah yeah now what we have to do a text now enter and you three numbers as a comma b comma c we are using here three variables a b c why three variables because we are going to find the greater number among two sorry among three numbers before i have done one question to find the greater number among two numbers in such condition we have to enter two variable a and b only but here we are going to find the greater number among three numbers that's why we will enter here three variables a b c now what we are going to do is now we are going to check the condition now to check the condition we have decision making box first let's make shape here arrow shape now we need to make decision making box that is right symbol you can see yeah now over here this is your decision making symbol yeah now right click over here and add text now we will give the condition is a is greater than b and a is greater than c question mark and what will be the Condition. if this condition satisfy if this condition satisfy is a is greater than b and a is greater than c if this condition becomes true then obviously a will be the greater okay let's enter one arrow and make arrow from here one arrow from here yeah if this condition satisfy is a is greater than b and a is greater than c then what happens a will be the greater if this condition satisfy if this condition satisfy it means if this condition becomes true then a will be the greater okay now let's write here true if this condition became true true and what happens if this condition becomes true then a will be the greater now to display we have again parallelogram we will design here parallelogram shape and now if this condition is a is greater than b and a is greater than c if this condition is true then what happens then a text Again, right here display is 
is greater is greater in the same way now if this condition does not satisfy if this condition again false does not satisfy what happens now let's check another condition okay we will go to another condition let's make here arrow first arrow first we will go to next condition now again check the condition we have again height or you can say diamond shape symbol there it is now checking the next condition if this condition again false let's write here false once if this condition became false then what happens again we will check the next condition here text is b is greater than a and b is greater than c let's make it bigger this shape make it but bigger yes should be in middle exit yeah now checking the condition next condition if this condition if this condition satisfy then what happens obviously b will be the greater is b is greater than a and b is greater than c if this condition became true or satisfy and obviously b will be the greater okay let's use arrow key now and here let's use arrow okay then again now if this condition became true so then what happens b will be the greater okay let's display b to display we have again parallelogram symbol okay go here parallelogram symbol and drag over here and bring it to just arrow key now a text display b is greater display b is greater yeah now let's put a little bit down the side now if this condition became false obviously c will be the greater yeah okay now use arrow again over here and after now if this condition became false if this condition if is b greater than a and b greater than c if this condition does not satisfy then obviously the greater number will be c now let's use parallelogram symbol again to display here it is parallelogram symbol yeah let's use here parallelogram symbol now finally a text display c is greater display c is greater yeah this is a full chart now we need to use stop 
here we write false is a is sorry b is greater than a and b is greater than c if this condition became false then obviously c will be the greater so display c is greater in parallelogram symbol hope you understood once again i will make you understand from very beginning okay first let's stop the flowchart now our flowchart is almost completed here it is this is stop now use arrow key from here here to here arrow key and right click and create text it's stop yeah now from here also we need to make one arrow false this every last result should go to stop Mm -hmm. Now to final one, and here to stop. Yeah, and from here also, on display be easy reader. From here also, we need to. on arrow key that it goes to stop yeah in this way the fourth chart to find greater number among three number is updated okay let me explain once again okay mm, question is draw flow chart to find greater number among three numbers okay let's get it started as first we have made oval symbol to start the flow chart as you all know that our full chart starts with oval symbol it start and as we are going to find greater number among three numbers so we will enter here three variables enter any three numbers as a comma b comma c these three are variables why in parallelogram because to input and to display the result we have to use parallelogram symbol so are using here parallelogram symbol to input three variables now why three because we are going to find the greater number and three numbers okay now after entering three numbers and what we do we will check the condition is a is greater than b and a is greater than c if this condition became true then obviously a will be greater so in parallelogram symbol display a is greater if this condition does not satisfy this first condition does not satisfy again we will check the next condition is b is greater than a and b is greater than c if this condition is satisfy or true then obviously a will be greater so display b is greater in parallelogram symbol if this condition does not satisfy second condition does not satisfy then obviously greater number will be c so display c is greater and finally our full chart is completed so stop from here from here to here also stop and our full chart is completed hope you understood the greater number among three number if you have any confusion please don't forget to comment below please subscribe to the channel for more update and knowledge thank you